If you've noticed the Steam Deck keyboard is freezing when you try to bring it up in desktop mode, then I have a few suggestions that should be able to help fix it for you. So last week, when I tried to install the NVIDIA GeForce Now streaming service on my Steam Deck, this required me to reboot the Steam Deck from gaming mode over into desktop mode. As soon as I booted into desktop mode, I attempted to visit the official NVIDIA landing page for the GeForce Now website, but when I tried typing in the web address, the entire software stack on the Steam Deck would just freeze up. The buttons would refuse to do anything when I pressed them, the trackpad did not control the mouse in any way, I was just unable to do anything except press and hold the power button until the device shut off. Multiple reboots did not fix anything either, as each attempt to bring up the keyboard while in desktop mode resulted in my OLED Steam Deck freezing up. So after doing a bit of research, I found multiple suggestions for what helped various people solve this exact issue. And that's what I'll be going over in today's video. So the first thing that I found on Reddit has the OP claiming they needed to uninstall Decky Loader before the frozen keyboard issue was solved on their Steam Deck. So if that's something you want to do, you'll need to find that Decky Loader installer launch it, you may need to re-download it if you have deleted it, and then from there you have the choice to uninstall it. Now I will say that being required to remove this did not seem likely as Decky Loader shouldn't be running after you boot the device into desktop mode. In any case, there were multiple people in that thread suggesting that it was related to Decky Loader, and some of those people found workarounds by switching from the stable build of Decky Loader to the preview build, or vice versa. Now, in the comment section of that thread, someone else on Reddit said that they were able to fix it by opening up the Steam client before you needed to type anything. So all they did was load into desktop mode, find the Steam icon, and then double click it so that Steam was then launched. This has helped a lot of people as it seems there's a bug that bogs down the Steam Deck while it's in desktop mode. When this bug is active on your system, launching the keyboard while the software is lagging will result in the entire operating system becoming frozen and locking up. Some even said that they just left their Steam Deck in desktop mode after trying to launch Steam, just to let the entire operating system catch up, so to speak. And after a while, they noticed the Steam client opening and closing really quickly as it went through the process and caught up. And then after that, they confirmed the keyboard no longer froze up the system. Now, some others have said that they chose not to wait through it all, and instead they killed the Steam client through the System Monitor application. So they went down here to the Start menu, so to speak, the Application Launcher, found the System Monitor application, then from there they killed the Steam client. If you do this before trying to launch the keyboard, then you should be able to load up Steam again, and then the keyboard should work like normal. While researching this issue, another person ended up switching keyboards to fix the bug. So they came down here to the taskbar and launched the Discover application, and then they did a search for the core keyboard. And whatever bug is causing the stock Steam Deck keyboard to freeze does not seem to impact third-party keyboards. 
and they said they've been using the Core keyboard ever since. Personally, I thought the bug was related to me being on the beta build of SteamOS. So I rebooted the Steam Deck back into gaming mode and then launched into the settings menu. From here, I went to the system section and then I changed the system update channel from beta to stable. After changing this, you'll be instructed to reboot the Steam Deck and then it will complete that switch. You could choose to switch back to the beta build once you have fixed that keyboard issue. Since the transition itself seems to have fixed the bugged out keyboard on my Steam Deck. It's clear there are a number of ways that we can solve this frozen keyboard issue, but it's left me curious as to how many different ways this bug can be triggered. It's possible that one of these methods will only work for a particular cause that's triggering the bug. And that's why I decided to include all four solutions in this single video. Hopefully it will be helpful to the majority of those experiencing this bug, but please let me know if you still need help. There are some more advanced things that we could try to fix this issue, but those may be best suited for dedicated videos instead of adding on to this now reasonably long video. Either way, use the comments section below to let me know.